Okay. Sorry, y'all. This might be chaotic. I'm going to probably move this phone. It is freezing here in Atlanta. For, look, look, look. Ooh, I know y'all like, why you got the heat on? Well, for anybody new to my channel, I live in a travel trailer and it does not come with heat because who goes camping in the winter? So, and yes, I do own a space heater that works very well, but I can't run the stove and the space heater due to electricity. It'll break the breaker, right? All right, so basically, I saw on Instagram another vegan. I think her name is, uh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I forgot. I'll put it in the comments later. I forgot because I do want to give credit for the idea. But she took Heart of Palm and she uh, made like, I'm not going to call these crab legs. I really don't think they're going to taste like crab legs. But I did season them up really, really well with uh, some Old Bay, some parsley, some herb seasoning. Mm, smells really good. It's actually been marinating for some days because I, I didn't forget about it. I just didn't have time to fry it. So we're going to take our Heart of Palm out. Just a bunch of seasoning. I think some kelp is on here as well. And then I'm going to shred the bottom part. I'm going to have to move the phone, y'all. I don't... I'm also making cabbage. Hey, Lakia! Also making cabbage, which y'all heard. Let me move the phone down a little bit. The trailer is a mess because it's too cold to clean up. I'm so sorry about it. <laughs> I'm so sorry about it. Let me put it down low for y'all. Okay. Let me move all this stuff out of the way. All this seasoning. All right, so here is one of our heart of palm here. And I'm just going to kind of... Oh, let me scrape this way. Oh, this scrapes off some of my seasoning. Okay. So I'm kind of scraping. Can y'all see? Kind of scraping down a little bit. So it has like a crab leggy feel to it. But I know it's not going to be crab legs. Okay. So like that. Boom. I'm just going to put this in a bowl. I'm only going to do like two. This is actually for tomorrow. I go with my family for Christmas dinner. I'm the only vegan. They're making like thanksgiving part two i don't want thanksgiving food so i'm gonna make me a seafood bowl seafood boil with ramen oh that one shredded real easy okay boom i have some shrimp in here as well we're gonna ignore that because again i'm not frying right now and i'm gonna cover this with some just egg okay let me make sure this is still good because so it's just egg been in my fridge for a minute okay listen it's for like that's crazy y'all i know <laughs> i'm not as cold as i look i am cold but i'm not as cold as i look oh my gosh so we just putting some just egg in here <laughs> oh my gosh now let's take the flour let's season it up i just bought this cajun seasoning today from kroger so let's just try it by mccormick's so i'm gonna put some in the bowl here into the flour Boom. And then let's put some slap your mama in here as well. Only because I, I feel like I wasted a lot of the seasoning when I shredded it. All right, so let's take our heart of palm here. Okay, boom. Uh-oh, let me mix this up. Oh, I broke it. That's all right. That's all right. I'm going to cover that. Ah, oh, it's breaking. Oh, my crab is breaking okay let's put it in the oil Whew. i'm freezing this is chaotic it's chaotic i don't have my thing okay boom oh my god my hand i didn't think this through hey happy holidays i know i've been really conscious since the society is so sensitive baby i ain't telling nobody merry christmas happy holidays <laughs> Ooh, it's a season for me so yeah, just in case you just joined, I'm making a seafood bowl for tomorrow for my family, but we're not leaving until noon. So I'm really going to fry the rest of this tomorrow. Obviously, I don't want cold fried stuff. I'm just doing a little experiment to see if I'm going to add this to my bowl. And I figured, <coughs> oh baby, I seasoned that. Oh, I left the cabinets open on purpose too. Just, I don't know how a trailer works, y'all. Listen, I know I've been here for a little over a year, but I'm like, do my pipes freeze? Do my little plastic pipes freeze? So I've been leaving the cabinet and the, um, everything open just like my mom does inside the house so there's that on that all right so we do have a little bit of that fry in there boom i'm gonna put the rest of these pieces on in there too because what else am i gonna do with it oh thank you i don't know where that goes but thank you i didn't know that was an option thank you let me learn youtube i can get donations <laughs> but all right let me throw this on in here 
Okay, boom. So in my bowl, y'all, I'm going to be doing, um, like I said, I'm probably going to do these. Even if it don't taste like crab legs, I'm still going to probably throw them in there because I already opened the can. They're already seasoned. So we're going to do the crab legs, heart of palm crab legs. We're going to do some vegan shrimp. I have the Beyond Sausage. Let me show you guys. Y'all, I cannot wash my hands. I'm sorry. It's too, it's too. They're already clean, but I can't wash this flour off. I got the Beyond Sausage I'm going to put in there. I usually get field roast, but I want to switch it up. And you already know my family going to ask for some. Bless you so much. Thank you so much, Tanya. But um, my family's going to ask to taste it because I know it's going to look amazing. Amazing. Okay, so they're going to be like, let me taste that, cuz. I already know. So I want to I want to make something fill roast. I just think Beyond sausages would be more meat friendly than fill roast. That's the only reason I got it. The only reason. After five years. <laughs> Hi y'all. Oh, let me show y'all my hair. I do not like it. I got it done today. I don't like it. It's bantu knots and curls. I don't like it. I look like a little I like a little kid. Hold on, let me set y'all down so y'all can see. Hold on. Okay, I don't like it. Hold on. Maybe when it gets older, I'll like it. But right now, I do not like my hair. Okay. I look like first day of kindergarten. Yay! Oh, and in case you're wondering what this is, I covered up my camera because it's so cold in here. It's so cold in here. I'm going to leave the heater on overnight because, again, it's gonna, it's so it's like going to be zero degrees tonight. So, that's that on that. All right? All right, so our crab legs are still frying. Um, I have some melted butter here. Thank you. I don't like it. Mm, butter by itself tastes so, ooh, smells so good. I'm going to do, do, do something simple. Let's just do, because this ain't the real dip. This ain't my real broth. So, we're just going to do a little, thank y'all. I'm going to do a little garlic in here. Um, some Obey. Oh, thank you, guys. I just, I'm just not feeling it. I just look so like a little kid. Oh, not icy roads. That's why I didn't complain too much about how cold it is in um, Atlanta. Because I know some people have snow. And I'm so grateful. Y'all, I just got home at like 5 o'clock. I've been running. I had to get my hair done this morning. And then um, I had to shoot some things for Amazon as well. Because I'm in their affiliate program. Mm. Okay, so I just made a quick butter sauce. Just two little seasonings in there. Boom. Oh, sorry, y'all. I'm covering the whole camera. You can tell I'm lost without my tripod. I'm so lost without my tripod. So we got our butter sauce ready. Let's flip over our little heart of palm crab legs. Y'all can't see, but I'm just flipping. That's it. I think I'm going to start using just egg or find another substitute for double battering flour. Um, because I know just egg is expensive, but I do like how it fries better and it's a little less flour. It's just, it's less flour. Ooh. Jesus. <laughs> So I'm all for it. I'm going to attempt to go low carb in January, y'all. No, let me not say attempt. I am going low carb in January. So y'all will be getting a lot more flour-free, bread-free recipes. So I'm just making some cabbage, too. Yeah, y'all all keep safe. I figured people were home. I figured this is a good day to go live, even though this is just a recipe um, experiment. Um, I didn't season this with anything but a... Uh, bouillon cube and tabitha browns i finally ordered her seasoning off of amazon so i just got the sunshine seasoning and i'm gonna add some salt and pepper because you know this is salt free so that's it and because my cousins was like do y'all know who this they sent me a screenshot do you know who this is aaron do i know who queen mother is yes i know who queen mother is that's like we don't like her seasoning but we think about getting her cookbook so we can you know have like a meatless monday i'm like Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. All right, so boom. But hopefully, please, y'all, please be staying warm. I'm praying for the homeless. I hope that everybody's homeless population uh, made it to a warming station today. I'm, I'm really, I mean, I don't know the stats. I don't watch the news. But I'm pretty sure Atlanta provided. I didn't see anybody physically outside today. And I was outside about at least two hours today not outside outside but outside of my home for about two hours today and i didn't see anybody um you know outside shivering because i baby I, I kept a blanket in the car just in case uh because i was gonna give it out like i'm so serious i got plenty of blankets so i definitely can do away with some all right 
So I feel like I'm gonna go ahead and cut this off. I'm gonna go ahead and cut both of them off, y'all, because I'm gonna go ahead and turn my heater back on. Y'all remember we used to smoke when we was little? <laughs> so let me turn my little space heater back on that I'm gonna leave overnight. Ooh, okay. Don't look at my floor. Don't look at, don't, you didn't see nothing. You probably saw a lot. All right. So let's see. I'm looking for, I don't know where my tongues are. We'll just get something else. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not thinking it's going to be a good crab substitute, but like I said, I want to try it. Nothing beats a try but a fail. Is that the right phrase? Probably not. Pro probably not. Okay. Woo! Oh, what else is going to be in my boil? Sorry, I didn't finish telling y'all what's going to be in the bowl. So we're going to have our crab, um, of course our shrimp. I'm going to top it with some seaweed. My noodles are going to be from Emmy Eats. Okay, it's going to be the noodles. I know, real lover, hey, it either work or it don't, period. Um, I got some broccoli from Kroger. I got some corn. The only thing I'm taking out is obviously potatoes. Potatoes and ramen don't mix. Um, the shrimp, the sausage, yeah. It's going to look real good. Like I, already, I even got a little tin for it to go in. I want my family to be jealous. Oh, hold on. I messed up the jealous want them to be jealous okay because y'all gonna be eating thanksgiving food just with ham instead of turkey boring and no i'm not selling christmas plates this year y'all i thought about it but thanksgiving was so crazy and it's just i'm glad i didn't volunteer to because baby it's cold who was gonna be ripping and running who not me okay let me set y'all back up on my bootleg tripod and we're gonna get this little taste that was it y'all i just really want to show i just wanted to see if it was gonna work and I wanted to do it with y'all. So we made our little butter concoction. They don't look like crab legs at all. <laughs> they broke though. Okay. Let me let a little bit of more of that oil drain out. Let me get another piece. This one's more. Okay. Let me taste it by itself. It's got a good flavor. But the texture is giving heart of palm that tastes like seafood. Like it's still giving heart of palm. All right, let's dip it in our little bootleg quick butter. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm happy. Like I said, I think I'm going to try it with something else. Maybe, I don't know, I'm going to try a bunch of different mushrooms. We'll try it with oyster mushrooms. Well, king oyster mushrooms. We'll try it with lion's mane. And I really wish Enoki, E-N-O-K-I, I really wish those were still out. I can't find them anymore. I feel like they got recalled. But I don't know. Mmm. <laughs> it's giving heart of palm with a seafood kick. One thing, if I did want to do it differently, you know how I have it marinating right here? I have the outside marinating. I should have shredded it and then seasoned it. I, you know? I just beasoned out of TikTok Alfredo spaghetti baked for my family holiday. Hey, yes. I think I looked that up. I just bought some vegan Alfredo. Because this lady gave me a whole spaghetti squash. So I was like, hmm. I was going to make Alfredo with that as well. So, but yeah. This is just well seasoned heart upon. I mean, I wouldn't be mad at it if somebody gave it to me, but it ain't no crap. By no means. <laughs> and maybe for the color, I don't know how they got the orange on this shrimp. Like, it's covered in just egg. But you see how they got orange on the shrimp? I wonder how they did that. I would want um I would want that on here too. I wonder how they got color on here. Cause that would make it look a little bit more realistic. So hold on, let me read a comment. Mm, 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 mm. Uh oh. Oh, uh, yes. It's tending big time. Definitely try it. Okay, yeah. I definitely will. I'm not a TikToker. I'm on TikTok, but I suck at it. I'm more of a scroller. I am not good. Call me Old Lady Jane, okay? Oh. All right, I'm eating my little last piece, y'all. I'm just really eating fried heart of palm. It was a fail. <laughs> I just wanted to go live with y'all and see if it would work. I was like, I could do it without them, but I ain't talked to my people in so long. Mmm. Um. Maybe.
maybe. I kind of want to fry it though. Yeah, I don't know. It might be good sauteed, but remember, I'm gonna have the I'm gonna have the corn and all that good stuff. So it can be one of those pickup things. The ramen is just listen. I'm really just trying to flex on my meat eater family. It's not even really for me. I'm, I'm I just want to flex. I'm gonna call a spade a spade. I just want my food to look better than theirs. They slowed down the vegan jokes, but it's still there. It's still like they're still making chitlins tomorrow. <laughs> now all my family don't eat chitlins, but I'm just saying the fact that they do that somebody does. Uh -uh. Nope. All right, y'all. Well, that is it. I'm gonna sit my butt down by this heater and warm my toes. Woo! Hopefully everybody is doing well, and I will definitely see y'all in the next video. I'm gonna try to definitely do another video before the year's out. I don't know what it's gonna be yet. <laughs> if you have any uh, suggestions, you can leave them down below. But um, yeah, me neither. I've never bitten a piece of chitlin in my life. I was forced to try chicken and liver, and that was nasty. Okay, so ugh, not chicken and liver, liver and liver and onions. Ugh. That is so nasty, so nasty. Um, I think that's it. Quick shout out. I did venture out today when I was already out and got me a wrap from Tassili's. Okay, delicious. I did ask for a spinach wrap, but they gave me, oh, that was my fault. I just, I just heard myself out loud. I asked for a spinach wrap, but I meant a seaweed wrap. I was like, oh, they got my order wrong. Eat it anyway. They didn't get it wrong. My, that was me. I asked for a, a spinach wrap instead of a seaweed. Because when I go low carb, I got to do seaweed wraps. But anyway. Alrighty, y'all. I'm going to talk to y'all later. Bye. Good night. Oh, and Merry, happy holidays and Merry to anybody who celebrates. Okay. Oh, wait. Quick question. How do you feel about imitation crabs? Um, Like the meat from the Asian market? Um, It's a, it's a I mean, to me, honestly, it's the same as the mock shrimp, but it just be a different texture sometimes. But I haven't cooked with it enough to give a real a good opinion on it. But I, I have no problem with imitation meats right now. Like, people always say, why you don't eat Beyond Impossible? I just don't like it, y'all. Ain't no reason. Eat the eat the, eat the the mock meat if you want to. It just ain't my jam. It just ain't my jam. That's it. Because I still, like I said, I don't really prefer that Beyond Sausage anymore because it tastes too real. But, yeah, the crab sticks, yeah. Mm. I've had those once and it just tasted okay. But I might try them again. It's been a long time. Maybe I need to boil them. I don't think I boiled them first. It's a bunch of different reasons. But I'll, I'll try because I really do want to get some sort of fried crabby stick again. You know, I even got some rice paper. But now that I think about it, uh, crab legs aren't fatty. They're one of the leanest meats. So really, I got that rice paper for no daggone reason. But anyway, all right. I don't want to hold y'all. I don't want to hold y'all. I'm going to sit here in front of this heater, warm up. Um... And then leave it on for the night because it's going to be so cold. Y'all stay bundled up. Stay warm. I'm probably going to sleep in a jacket tonight. Okay, I'm not. No, it's warm in the house. I'm tripping. I ain't sleeping out here tonight. I'm sleeping in my mama's house. <laughs> All right, y'all. Y'all have a good night. Bye.